broken my nail. <laughs> it's Saturday. I look terrifying. Gross. Yeah. What's that on the chin? <laughs> I mean, dark lipstick is never a good idea for me. I really like it. It's gone everywhere. <laughs> I'm not happy. They've had a very angry uh, message. <laughs> well, actually, with those on the back. Yeah. You're a little bit like, what's your name? What color do you want? What color do you want? Sparkly. Oh my god, the laces. I know. That's so cute. <laughs> I mean, do a height difference. <laughs> Even when I'm wearing my biggest shoes. There we go. <laughs> I feel so small. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I like the difference. <laughs> I, I knew you were going to say that. They just put them on, I was like, fucking gonna like them. Entire lineup of shoes, though. <laughs> I do love those. They're brand new in as well. So, like, they're pretty new. Beautiful. Them. Like, nice for them. <laughs> so mine. So many. <laughs> what are you like? <laughs> My lipstick has fully come off, but we're in the Street Life Museum. And we're in, the, in there a, a big ass tram. I'm gonna take some pictures because child left trap. But we've just been into Doc Martens, as you'll have seen from the last couple of clips, because I've I tried to vlog properly, but there's loads of kids in there and it was really busy. We made friends with a girl called Rosie, who I now love. Um, we followed each other on Instagram and everything, didn't we? But um, our lady over here has come away with her four pairs of Doc Martens. Oh. And a Primark haul. And a Primark haul. But we'll probably do that in the car. She'll go through everything in the car later. Um, we're having a really, really nice day so far. Like, it's what, like half past one? Yeah. So, like, we're cramming a lot into the day. I'm so Sleep happy. Sleep past two. Sleep past two? Yeah. Oh, we're we're I know, I know. We wanted to go and see Venom, but I don't think we're going to have enough time. <laughs> oh, some nice uniforms behind me. <laughs> There's a scary man up there, and it looks like Amy's looking at him. Right there, Amy Johnson, pal. And yeah, he's looking right at her. He's mad at Amy. Never noticed this tiny little movie theater before. That's so cute. Meow. Does this mean I'm staring the tram? <laughs> I feel like a pearl dancer. Oh, not when you're in a vinyl skirt. <laughs> These are hands down the scariest things in the world. Horrible. Oh, I think it might work as well. No. Update of our um... <laughs> when it's going really, really, really. The first time I've used the self timer on it, so. Ah! Go on! <laughs> Can I get a little okay, yellow monkey? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, he's got Bill for a hand. <laughs> Small. Aww. What are you going to get? A penguin. Aww. You happy with your penguin? 
cute. Yes. So, we've just had a moment. Oh wait, I've got one minute left. One second. <laughs> anyway, um, keep. I need to change my shoes. We've just had a really nice time at the fair. I have my little monkey friend. I also had some noodles, and there's a cute little penguin. And Charlie had Bob Carver's for the first time, which is exciting. It was really cute good. pictures. And now it started raining, so we left at a good time. Unfortunately, as nice as the day has been. Um, and I think I've spoken about this every time it's happened because I think I've been vlogging every day we've hung out, yeah. um, like ever. For every wonderful person you meet in a day, yeah. you meet an asshole. But our angel of the day is a girl called Rosie. So when we went into the Doc Martin shop today, and Charlie spent an obscene amount of money on some fucking amazing shoes. They are amazing shoes. Like. I'm they so are. jealous. They will all I'm have just taking mine appeared off. in the video already. Yeah, I think I don't want to drop my shoes on. Never mind. Don't want to drop my shoes in my popcorn. Drop my shoes in my popcorn. I need my shoes to drive it. Because I can't drive in this. Um Yeah, she was absolutely fantastic, this girl Rosie. She was just chatting to us we was in there for 45 minutes. 45 minutes. And like before we'd even like said about trying shoes on or um, like wanting to buy anything she came straight over and was chatting to us and was asking us loads of questions and then she saw my camera and she was like oh do you vlog do you have a youtube channel i was like yeah and then we were just proper chatting about loads of stuff yeah. weren't we like and it was just, music shoes like it was just a really nice there. experience as well such a good shopping and experience like no pressure to actually buy anything no like none like, at all and then she was talking prices about stuff and like sizing because she's got quite big feet as well yeah. as you aren't she? she's got the same size feet as yeah me, which was actually really it was like, nice wasn't good. it yeah yeah because uh, she knew what she was talking about um with yeah. and it was all very honest as well it wasn't yeah, she was, she was just, honestly, she was fantastic. You could tell she was really excited to talk to us. Um, and she was like, oh, as soon as you walked in, I clocked your shoes, meaning my, um, my lazy earth docks, and was chatting about that for a bit. And, oh, we just had a dead nice time. It was so lovely. It was a really nice day. And, uh, but then, the dickhead of the day, my lipstick has fully come off, on it? I was wearing lipstick Mine's earlier. just about still there. Um, we have our dickhead of the day, who spoke to us when we were walking back to the car where we are now after going to the fair such a good time at the fair it was so cute we could only go for an hour unfortunately because we could only find parking for an hour for free because i don't want to pay for parking again i've already paid for parking today and we was walking down having a nice chat and i'd clocked a couple of people looking at her a bit funny and they always rubs me up the wrong way and it's not like a hero complex where i'm like i need to defend her because she can't do it herself like i know you can defend yourself and be nervous i times. can if you've never met me she can't defend herself. She can't defend herself. Um, but I get this, like, I'd do it for anybody, like you were saying, like, if it was a stranger walking down the street and I heard someone talking to him like that, I'd have fucking said the same thing. Because also, went, if you did have a hero complex, I'd have... You'd have beaten it out of me by now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the fuck. What are you being friends with me for, you weirdo? Um, and this guy just started laughing and I immediately turned around and looked at him and he went, you look a bit strong. And then he said something else as well. And I, I can't remember what it was because I literally, as soon as I heard that, I was like season and i turned around and went what did i say like Stop who the fuck do you think you're talking to oh. <laughs> that was the last <laughs> i was like who the fuck do you think you're talking to or like what the fuck like you know you can't talk to people like that whatever like aggressively yeah. and he had kids with him like little kids like small kids and i was just like this man this idiot and i was like set a really good example for your kids there aren't you and he went he said something else because he carried on walking away but i turned around and like stopped in the street and like shouted at him but he was carrying on walking away and like he was with another guy two girls yeah, and like four kids and all of them just carried on walking as well they didn't say anything look at anything and then he shouted again like something like something about me being nasty or an idiot or like swear words and i just went stop fucking breeding and walked away <laughs> and i had the monkey around my neck the whole time just like this monkey around my neck shouting at a bigot in the street it was both one of the most hilarious and most surreal things it i think really I've ever seen. <laughs> it was so funny it was so fucking funny 
Oh my god. So take this as a lesson. Don't if be a cunt. <laughs> that's it, that's all you need to know. Don't be a cunt. I was going to say, next time you say something cuntish, you may get shouted at by a lady with a yellow monkey around her neck. And very, very gothic eye makeup. Amazing eye makeup. Thanks. Need some eye makeup again. Yeah. I love my monkey. He's so stylish. What a beautiful day. <laughs> my voice is going again. We have come to the foreshore to see the Humber Bridge. Charlie's taking pictures. Mm. And it's golden hours, if you can't tell, because my face is literally like fucking orange right now. The bridge is beautiful and the tide's right in. It looks gorgeous. So there's my bridge. I love it. And that is how close the tide is coming. Ugh, beautiful. I'm going to take some the last finishing shots of my outfit for the last instalment of my favourite modern, uh, favourite women from modern music, favourite modern women. Um, and hopefully we're going to take them here because the lighting is beautiful. You're just excited, aren't you? I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> You're so zoomed in on my face. So Goof face. Oh, it's just beautiful. And I can't see it all. So I put my sunglasses on. Yeah. I should have put mine on in the car as well. And take some pictures now. Mm, nice. So, as we have been shopping today, and when I say we, I mean that one. It was taking <laughs> shoes. I bought a thing. A beautiful coat. Isn't it so beautiful? I know I bought popcorn. You bought popcorn. I love my coat. It's really hard to haul anything when it's like the sun's already set and you can't see anything. It's green. And we've just taken the most amazing pictures, haven't we? They like, are going to be. The most amazing pictures. Yeah, I think the favorite, my favourite photos I've ever taken. Yeah. Like, I fully am on board with that. I think that. I'm so excited. We're going to go through them soon. We'll start with your Primark stuff. So stand up. She's already wearing one, and because you're a fucking giant, <laughs> it's the cutest purple tan skirt in the world. Really nice. Also tights. Oh, and tights. Emergency tights. And then this. And then, yes. Because the outfit that I was wearing this afternoon, as I Bro. mentioned in the video, snaps. So, you go to... This top shop fucking sucks, but Primark yeah, is the one. Because I wore this lovely jumpsuit, it's now inside out. <laughs> what I had on. And the but handle... Handle? Handles. The, so hand, the, the, the handle hand, snaps. The handle snap. <laughs> Handle. No, that's the, that, there we go. Look. The handle, the snapped handle, right there. Culprit. So. Fuck that. Rest of the tights. Rest of the tights. It was 60 dernier appearance. So, probably not 60 dernier. No, I can confirm they are not 60 dernier. Top spot. Is that the neck? Yeah. yeah. Kitty. Really nice. Really like long. Oh, that's and soft that. And soft. I should put it in front of that's your face. Really nice. Hi, Jane. <laughs> <laughs> pair of tights from the pack of three. Yeah. The pair of tights. Oh, the dress. Also from the pack of three. Ooh, more tights. Really cute. Like, Ooh, which was the as seen in glamour bit? Was that it skirt? was the skirt, yeah. How beautiful is that? What was it? I love it. I have anything with a ring pull. Beautiful. It's my first thing with a ring pull. I love a good ring pull. So. So that was that was the Primark haul, which actually was. Which the came second. after. The um, the barrage of because one, I was, yes. two, I'm just going to put them all on you, <laughs> three, four, yeah. four. Because I made a throwaway comment to Meg. That she'd never bought a pair of Doc Martens. I had never ever bought a pair of Doc Martens. And so Meg said, let's go to the Doc Martin shop. I said, yes, let's go to the Doc Martin shop. Doc Martins are great. And that's when we made our new best friend, Rosie. Made our new best friend, Rosie, who I is probably watching this, to be fair. Should we love you, Rosie. Know? We do. Um, and I, yes, yeah, started off. No, let's start with... Oh, we're starting chronological order. Start with... Do the honours. Start with these. No. <laughs> Pink glittery ladies. Legs have gone. Yeah, I'm, I'm... The most beautiful shoes in the whole world. They're so fucking charming. They are the most me shoes. 
In the world. In the world. These First, are the ones that I want. These are the ones that you want. And what you should do is you should get a pair and then we should do another twinning video. Yeah. I want those to about okay. you can do the honours in the meantime. Look! So double platform, so black, fucking sparkly ribbon, fucking laced. Now I've wanted some heel docks for ages. A really good friend of mine posted some doc like heel docks on Twitter and who I was just it? Sort of Elena. I know who Elena is. Yeah. yeah. Elena posted some heel docks on Twitter and I was like, I need them. I need them. It's completed. Okay. It's copied over 400 images over. We've taken a fuck ton. A fuck ton. Okay. I'm so obsessed with um, this coat. So, yes, I wanted some heel docks and they had like heeled boots. Chelsea boots. So I got these. And they are, like, don't they don't know. look that much like just but on. there. But they once look I put weirdly them on, elegant. They just, yeah, they're like really almost dainty. Yeah, and just they made like you legs, look really yeah, good. and they made my legs look even longer and even slimmer than they already are. So pretty much straight away, I was like, I'm having those. And then... Um, I was like, you really can't buy a dot mines unless you buy tea bars. Yes, because whilst we were in the shop, I was like, I might as well try on everything I like. And we had a look around, but at first we didn't see any particularly inspiring tea bars. And then we saw, and then we saw these. They're classic. Basic, yes, they are like the They're very classic. soggy. She's been wearing they them all evening. I wore, yes, I changed them to these earlier. And they are beautiful. We're fucking giant feet. And so pretty much straight away agreed to get those. And then with the 20% off, we figured out that basically if she's buying four pairs, one of them would be free. Yeah. So the cost of buying an extra pair with the fourth pair would, like the discount would overall, be free. buy three, get one free. Would be effectively so that was why i got the black sparkly ones so now there. so now i have here we are. went from zero to four from from zero pairs of dots to in four 45 pairs of minutes dots in the space of 45 minutes and, and we made a new friend i also then got the socks the sparkly socks They're sparkly to match like put them right in my face and weirdly to today this morning i'd already put on these socks Yes. I totally saw my ass. <laughs> These socks. <laughs> We've had such a good day, haven't we? We always have a good day. Mm -hmm. I love this coat so much. This is an amazing coat. As soon as you put it on, I was like, it's you. And you were like, mm, I need to look in the mirror. And I was like, no, it's you. Because I, I was expecting it. It looks funny right now. But it's one of the things with teddy bear coats. They look so cute on everybody. And I didn't like the colours of them because it wouldn't have gone with my hair, it wouldn't have gone with my skin, it made me look funny. And I saw this one and it's like denim jacket style with the pockets. Mm. And I put it on, I was like, this feels fantastic, but I know it's going to look funny on me. Weirdly flattering. You can't really tell, but it looks really nice. I promise. The label's stabbing me. <laughs> but we've had a really nice time shopping, taking pictures. <clears throat> what else did we do? We went to the museum. Went to the museum, yeah. To look at a tram. Because I'm a nerd. Because she's a nerd. We went to the fair. Yes, we went to the fair. We went to the oh, fair and I got my monkey. And you got your penguin. You put, yeah, and, they're great. and then I shouted at the bigot whilst wearing a bright yellow monkey around my neck. Because that is what I do on a Saturday. one of the most amazing things I've ever seen. It's always a pleasure to come and appear on your channel. Mm -hmm. Thank you for coming to see me. Thank you for inviting me. We'll have to catch up again soon. I always do this when I want to hug from someone. I don't hug them, I just like put my head yeah. down and I'm like, hug me. So huggable though. Especially when I'm wearing this coat. <laughs> oh, good afternoon. I look like an actual egg. And I'm gonna have to do the ugly angle again. Seatbelt time. We have just been to pick up some paint um, from a stranger. <laughs> from a stranger for one of Ashley's colleagues at work. And as soon as we walked away, carrying a big thing of paint each I mean, she definitely thought we were lesbians. This happens all the time. When me and Ashley go and like run errands together, people definitely think we're together. And then Ashley went, well, we have to paint our les pad pink. <laughs> so yeah, les pad is 100% what we would call it, because it's lad pad. Lad pad. Lad pad, but les pad. <laughs> it's, the then, it's, it, it's the cut off trousers. It's the cut off trousers, it's the cut off trousers. 
just got cloth trousers. And then um, she, I was putting the paint in the boot and she was like closing it. And I said, I was already gonna trap my head in the oven then. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit weird. She went, all right, Sylvia Plot. <laughs> I, was, I was gonna say, that. never in my life did I ever think I would have a reason to say, all right, Sylvia Plot. <laughs> you are right. <laughs> it was so oh my oh, god. Like that. I was my you, eyes are crying. I was telling you mum a story yesterday, and I couldn't even tell at the end because I was fucking so <laughs> What was it? <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> I was over it. I know. Right, so I was saying how like I've had a bit of like, you know, like I've had a stressful week and um, I went to the toilet, I sat down, I opened the tampon. Oh yeah! <laughs> yeah, but it got worse, so like I opened the tampon, I threw the tampon in the bin and I was sat there with the packet and I was just like, no Ash, that's not right. Can't put that up there, can you? <laughs> On Friday, I was on duty and like we have the list and we're supposed to shred it afterwards. I know I went to one of my colleagues. Oh yeah, we're supposed to shred this. Put this in the bin afterwards. And he was like, Oh yeah, yeah, make sure you do. So I got up, I picked up my highlighters, I walked over to the bin, I threw them in the bin, <laughs> <laughs> and then I sat down. And Kevin went, Are they are they not working? And I looked over and I was like, <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. So yeah, we've <laughs> we're having a nice time. Where are we going? So, um... <laughs> Don't know. Mum's got some biscuits of mine that I could do with collecting. Oh, we're going to get some biscuits. So today our plan is to we're going to pick up my biscuits. Do some errands. Yeah, do some errands. I begin to think it's me. <laughs> I'm just wobbly. I'm like one of those weevil wobbles. You know the ones with the round bottoms? Oh. And when you knock them over, they just kind of go... Rowan's got loads of them things, you know, like them solar things that go... Oh, cute. Rowan has some weird toys, doesn't he? He likes Halloween toys too. We'll have to get him some. Yeah. We'll have to get him some Halloween toys. I still haven't decided what I want to be for Halloween this year. No. I would like some help. I don't know. Because I wanted to be Miss Argentina, but I think it's going to take too much effort. And I usually don't... Like, I love putting that much effort into Halloween, but I just... I don't think I have the time for it this year. Right. All the resources. Um, I went through and edited all of the photos me and Charlie took yesterday, and I am obsessed with them. Usually, I will put up to well, between like five and ten photos in a book post, won't I? Normally, there's 19 in this one. I need to up my photography game, don't I? I can't not be. To be that. fair, you're always my favourite. I love you. Where is it? I just look like. Um, Inspector Gadget. That is hilarious. Stallman in every weekend vlog now, find something to stroke. That feels weird. Give it like a good. I quite like it. Time for tea. Christmas raccoon. Mm -hmm. I don't hear it. Mm. <laughs> 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 that creepy mouth. Is it? Creepy. <laughs> What's its problem? <laughs> Do you not want to put your hat on? <laughs> no. I have been gifted. Whopper nopper. Is that what you called it? A whopper nopper. Um, on my shoulder, so I've got a shoulder whopper nopper. We had a great time in the range. Our quick visit to the range. We were there for about an hour. Sorry. It's not your fault. Go past McDonald's and make me want to cry. Uh, 
I'd rather not go. I really want to go to McDonald's. Same. But we'll, we'll, we'll be eating soon. I know. But then I'm also thinking, like, should we just go to McDonald's and sack off or something? Okay. No, I want my toad in the hole. Yeah, we went to go and look at the Halloween decorations. And then we ended up in the seven million aisles of Christmas. Um, so that was really fun, wasn't it? I know, I've got an upper. So we didn't actually buy anything Halloween or Christmas related from the range. We just bought food. Uh, that's what me and my mum do all the time. We'll go there all the time and we just buy food. Well, she wanted the knobbly, the knobbly cheetahs. <laughs> and apparently they only sell them there. But I got Transformer snacks and a uh, shot of the knobbly, so I'm happy. Oh, I just remembered what uh, what happened when I walked into your mum's house. <laughs> Ashley just went in and then she went, no, you've got to stay there to me and closed the door. So I was stood in the little porch bit on a Halloween doormat that was making loads of noises. Um, so I just assumed something else was going to happen, but I didn't know what. And I been stood there for an extra couple of seconds wondering what was going on. And she opened the curtain and then a big spider dropped down onto my head and I screamed. <laughs> it was so funny. I was so upset I didn't film it. It was hilarious. She's making the haunted house, isn't she? Halloween. Can have party. Can have party. We have been having <laughs> the biggest nightmare in the world, haven't we? The world's out to get us. So we decided we were gonna go get Ashley's now TV box, plug it in at my house, watch Kardashians. Brought Ashley's now TV box around. My wire does not fit in her now TV box. Even though we both have now TV boxes, apparently they're just not the same, so it doesn't work. And I, mean, um, I think that black one's newer. Is it's it? got a different power cable. Because I only bought that about a year ago. And then we were going to go and get the wire. And Ashley left her house keys in her car because we were going to go in my car because she got a parking space out of the front by a park around the back. But then I needed to lock the front door and then it, it was just all very um, dramatic for a while, wasn't it? And then... We've got hair wire, we plug it into the TV and um, it won't connect to the internet. Couldn't figure out why. Put the password in twice, did a system reset. You know what Ashley did? Ashley unplugged the Wi Fi instead of my now TV box. So now, hopefully, it will work and we can uh, sit and have our Sunday dinner, eat our crisps because. The range is fantastic. And this is the biggest bag of quivers I've ever seen. And we took some dead cute pictures in the garden, didn't we? Mm -hmm. So we're going to post those on Instagram too. We're such a dream team. But now I'm going to put the password in and we're actually going to get our evening started. Yes. We're so excited. Are we just having the best day? <laughs> I can't say what I was there for. Sad Keanu. Keanu. <laughs> Do you believe in love? Yeah. Oh, he's a singer, but it's a it's an animal as well that lives in the water and it's got like little it's fat and they've got flippers and what? Seal! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Step up, magic mic, absolute fucking bear. Love of your life, Shannon Tatum. Yeah. <laughs> the one we've just been watching, uh, the one with the DUI. <laughs> Call again, <Ashton. laughs> Uh on your nipples. That's all. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Dirt Shaggy Friends X. A flag? No, don't do it. It's one of the rules of... Like, gal curse? Yes. Fancy word for underwear. Lingerie? Yeah. <laughs> um, Batman? Um, Robin? No, Batman. <laughs> the actor who played Batman. Um, most recently with a stupid... Bear. Yeah, with a stupid voice. Um... A cigarette, but fancy. A cigar? Yeah. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> Something else you put on your nipples um, to cover them up when you're in a dress. A bra? No, like the little things that you put over them when you're when um, you're not wearing anything. Yeah. Pasties. Pasties. <laughs> this is so weird. I don't know who that is. Who's Deck Diggler? 
Dat is in Amsterdam. Kijk, ik denk dat het was. Ik denk dat het The boy equivalent of sisters before misters. Fries. Before guys. What? Nee. Extra boobs. <laughs> Extra boobs. Think of it. Extra boobs. <laughs> I just wanted to capture the moment that I get into my freshly made bed with my lovely jersey bed in navy blue and baby blue so cute and soft and I want oh so cozy night night it's actually Monday night it's 11 p.m. Halfway through drying my hair, the bottom is dry, the top ain't. I'm not vlogged today because I felt rubbish. Finally got over my cold. And my period slaps me like a ton of fucking bricks. It's literally annihilated me today. Work was alright, I was in Pontefract, so an hour away. And it was primary school, I was working with one of my favourite people uh, from work who I've not really worked with many times, twice before I think, but she's really lovely, really nice, um, like no bullshit, kind of nice, I like her, we get along well, and um, yeah we were done by two and then home by three-ish, maybe just after three, and then at half past four I fell asleep, seems to be a pattern for me some days of the week now, which is rubbish. But I woke up at just gone seven with the worst period pains I've ever had in my life. Um, but the pain unfortunately struck whilst I was at work. Thankfully near the end of the day, uh, around lunchtime. And then on my drive home, because I thought it was just like IBS pain and normal stomach cramps that I get. And I was just like, I'll power through, I'll power through. And then um, on the drive home I was like, my period's coming, I can feel it. And I got home just in time, just in time. Um, but I took some of my boyfriend, fell asleep, woke up just past seven, feeling even worse. <laughs> Rang Ashley, feeling sorry for myself, and she took me to Asda, where I bought Dairy Lee Dunkers, sandwich thins, you know, the little bread thing. It's just because they keep really well in lunch boxes and they don't go soggy. And they're really good for pack ups. Um, I prefer sandwich thins, crumpets. And there was something else. I'm just really tired at this point. As you can tell because I'm hugging the bunny. I love this bunny. When Build a Bear first happened in Hull, um, me and George got teddies. So of course, since it was so long ago, she has a stupid name. She's called Shanene. It was around that time when that video came out where it was like a hundred most American names ever and it was like loads of real funny ones like Walter Melandrea and then number one was Courtney. So yeah, I hope everyone remembers that video, it was great. But yeah, I remember in last weekend's vlog I was um, raking through these to find one and they were on body form and I don't use body form. I bought them anyway because I really wanted this and it was like less than a pound. But now that I'm on my period, I can use my um, my duvet queen tin. I am queen of the duvet. Literally me. So, yeah, I can use this now and pop it in my bag for work. Live Fearless, illustration by Gemma Coral. Undea. Noise.
tomorrow is pay day I'm going to go to the fair I'm probably going to vlog it separately and do like a day at the fair vlog because um, it wouldn't be the same if I didn't film some bits and Dodger was in the fun house and things like that I'm just so tired Ugh. it's bedtime but yeah hope you enjoyed this weekend's vlog I'll see you next week